Once, the Premier of India stated that science and technology cannot apply for any development programs, but it is an intrinsic component in all development programs to sustain them for improved quality of life of a nation. Science is but correct thinking, critical to help meeting the challenges of sustainable development of a nation as it lays the foundation for new approaches, solutions and technologies to identify, clarify and tackle global challenges for the future. Science provides testable and reproducible answers, thus providing the basis for conclusive decision-making processes and effective impact assessments. Science spans the understanding of natural processes and human impacts. The prime goals are contribution of science to health and well-being and ways to improve subsistence and livelihood strategies to meet the overriding goal of poverty reduction. Science contributes significantly and directly to sustainable development. That covers the whole range of disciplines, from natural sciences to engineering to social sciences and the humanities. The 17 NIFS research groups align along with energy and advanced materials, theoretical physics and computational studies, natural products and food chemistry, microbiology and carbon sequestration, Earth Environmental and Biodiversity Molecular Biology and Biotechnology We should preserve every scrap of biodiversity as priceless while we learn to use it and come to understand what it means to humanity. NIFS Research Group on Evolution, Ecology and Biodiversity focus on understanding how the loss of biodiversity modifies ecosystems. Our researchers use taxonomy, molecular biology, phylogenetics and field ecology to build a comprehensive understanding of the evolutionary processes involved in the formation of biodiversity. In the modern world, our taste buds, our brain chemistry, our biochemistry, our hormones and our kitchens have been hijacked by food. The NIFS Food Chemistry Group focuses on exploring the application of food chemistry to underutilized plant resources. Adding value to the underutilized resources is vital as Sri Lanka has enriched the biodiversity of plant resources. The researchers also devise technologies to ensure the quality and authenticity of food products to safeguard consumers from fraudulent practices. The NIFS Nutritional Biochemistry Research aims at the functional and nutritional properties of food, food bioavailability and food safety. The NIFS Biochemistry researchers pursue in-depth research to probe food antioxidant properties, enzyme inhibition, radical-induced DNA damage and the identification and prevention of active compounds that pose health risks. The NIFS Microbial Biotechnology and Rhizobium researchers developed biofilm biofertilizers and rhizobium biofertilizer for agriculture and plantation crops. Biofilm biofertilizers are used over 15,000 acres of rice in Sri Lanka, cutting down 50% of chemical fertilizer usage while increasing crop yields by up to 40%. Rhizobium biofertilizers are now used in thousands of acres in legume cultivations replacing urea. Further fundamental researchers are underway to evaluate their potential as microbial ameliorators in the soil and the environment. The microbiology and soil ecosystems research focuses on determining the soil carbon sequestration potential, its dynamics, and the method of improvement in different major vegetation types of Sri Lanka. Our scientists use GIS technology for mapping of the carbon storage capacity of the Sri Lankan ecosystems. Molecular microbiology research interests revolve around microorganisms and human diseases. Our researchers aimed at understanding microbial diversity in the environment and also within the human body. It is often noted that taxonomy is sometimes science and sometimes an art. But really, 
it is a battleground. The NIFS Plant Taxonomy and Conservation Group is involved in taxonomic and biogeographic studies of flora of Sri Lanka, preparation of the national red list for flora, sustainable use of plant resources, identifying factors that affect the conservation of the flora of Sri Lanka, including the prevalence of invasive alien species and restoration of ecology. It is stated that you should never call anyone a baboon unless you are sure of your facts. The NIFS primate biology researchers conduct observational studies on primates in their natural forest habitats to understand their evolution of social behavior and provide a scientific basis for the effective management and conservation of primates and other organisms. Our scientific work has been buttressed by studies in population genetics, paternity exclusion, epidemiology and physiology, ecology and vital statistics of wild monkeys. Nobel laureate Olea said that one of the most significant mathematical discoveries of all times were guided by physics intuition. The NIFS Condensed Matter Physics and Solid State Chemistry Research Group seeks novel pathways to improve the performance of dye-sensitized solar cells using nitrogen-doped titanium dioxide or nanofiber-based gel electrolytes. They also engage in developing rechargeable batteries using magnesium ion conducting polymers. Low-cost nanofiber filters were also developed for arsenic removal in drinking water. The NIFS Condensed Matter Group also plays a pivotal role in the multi-university solar edu training research development and training programs administered through the Science, Technology and Research Ministry for building a youth workforce competent in solar technologies. The aim of the Energy and Advanced Materials Chemistry researchers is to devise new avenues for renewable energy. They devised artificial chemical devices to mimic the natural photosynthetic process to produce green fuels. The researchers also devised chemical and photochemical methods for pollution control. Additionally, a multifaceted approach was proposed to elucidate CKDU etiological factors. If we wish to make a new world, we must have the new material ready. Material processing and device fabrication researchers are involved in basic research in material processing and device fabrication with an emphasis on graphite, graphite-based devices, carbon supercapacitors. The NIFS materials researchers are also involved in the conversion of waste materials such as coconut shells to conducting activated charcoal for versatile applications in electronic devices to develop fast charge stations for the latest technology electrical motor vehicles. Nanotechnology is the science and art of manufacturing with atoms. Nanotechnology and physics of material researchers are active in the development of Sri Lankan graphite for rechargeable battery application, advanced transition metal semiconductors for energy conversion, fabrication of nanomaterials and composites from Sri Lankan graphite, and development of local minerals for efficient water purification. The objective of the NIFS Natural Products Research Group is the identification of bioactive compounds from natural sources as potential resources for control of human and plant diseases, including post-harvest fungal disease in horticultural fresh produce. Research activities focus on understanding the chemistry and bioactivity of secondary metabolites from plants fungi and the fruits of Sri Lanka using modern mass spectroscopic methods. If it is correct, it signifies the end of physics as a science. The main aim of the NIFS Computer Science, Mathematics and Statistics program is to conduct in-depth research to make scientific advances while nurturing young minds for critical thinking, for new knowledge generation. The nation is starving without novel critical thinking. To bridge the gap, this program specifically targets multidisciplinary approach in a wide range of areas including software engineering, artificial intelligence, image processing, machine learning, the Internet of Things, distributed systems, applied mathematics, 
mathematical modeling, data analytics and data science harnessing front-end information technology. The new knowledge gained by these programs will pave paths in developing innovative techniques in biology, chemistry, physics, geosciences and other disciplines for the enhancement of the national developing programs. Earth provides enough to satisfy every man's need, but not every man's greed. The Earth and Space Sciences Division has several multidisciplinary research programs, some of which are in the state of inception, while others are in the state of continuing and completion. This division has a broad spectrum of projects cross-cutting economic geology, mineralogy, petrology, geophysics, renewable energy, space technology, and multi-scale theoretical modeling to unravel the natural processes. The NIFS Environmental Science Research Group aligns as environmental sciences, plant and environmental sciences. In a broad sense, the research project addresses sustainable development goals of the United Nations, good health and well-being, clean water and sanitation, industry innovation and infrastructure, responsible consumption and production, and life on land. Our researchers also address nationally important questions such as improved water quality, zeolite-based composites, and phytoremediation of industrial and farm effluents. The NIFS is looking ahead to embark into fundamental research on philosophy and science history, ancient Sri Lankan technologies, a science and arts of archaeology, ethnic implications in science under social and philosophical sciences. The NIFS scientists are active around the clock to unravel the missing fundamental scientific components that retard the nation's development programs. We envisioned to be a world-renowned center of excellence for basic research.